Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and this is another little video showing you one of the cool features that you can have in Windows 8 that is the screen grab feature or um, what some people will call screen capture now in Windows screen captures or screen grabs were always available uh, using the print screen key on your keyboard and one of the problems with that key is that without any pieces of software um, a lot of people didn't understand what was happening they would uh, press the print screen and nothing would happen uh, because they didn't know that they had to uh, go and paste that image somewhere and so it was really really difficult for some people to use in Windows 8 they've really really improved the screen capture feature and they changed the name and they called it the screen grab feature what's cool in Windows 8 is that when you capture a screen shot it actually goes automatically into the capture folder in your pictures folder on Windows so as soon as you do a screen grab a new folder is created for you in the image or the pictures folder of your computer and all the captures you'll do will actually be there so how does it work? Um, it depends on your computer uh, some computers will have it directly others will have it using a combination so if you have a, a desktop or a laptop keep in mind that you might have to use two ways uh, one special way of doing it but on some computers it's going to be directly so um, for a lot of people doing a screen capture is as simple as holding on to the Windows key on your keyboard and going to press the print screen key on the upper right of your keyboard so you hold on your uh, Windows key and you press the screen the print screen uh, key and so you should your screen should probably flicker light, slightly and um, if it worked in your pictures folder so if you go for example in your file explorer or on your desktop and get into your folders in the pictures folder you'll see something that's called screenshots right here this screenshot right there is where things go if you are like me it maybe it didn't work you tried you hold on to the windows key and you did print screen nothing happened um, on my Toshiba computer I have to add another key for it to work um, if you notice on your keyboards you will there's a good chance on some laptops that you'll have different colors and the colors match the different keys that you have to use so for example I have some red and some blue on my keys and I have the function key that has some blue which means that the blue stuff is with the function key and the red stuff is with the alternate character key on the right side of my keyboard because it is red so you have to understand that so if Windows and print screen doesn't work try the combination that works for you in a Tosh my, my case with the Toshiba I have to hold on to the function key and then hold on to the Windows key and then I can do a print screen and you see the screen went slightly dark then came back if I go to my screenshot folder now in my pictures folder you'll see that in screenshots I now have the screenshot of what I just did just before I made the video I actually took a screenshot of the desktop which showed me the desktop so here you've got now your screenshots they're already saved for you so this is much much easier to actually do a screenshot and then use that picture to do whatever you want with it so um, really really a improved way of uh, actually doing a print screen or screen grab as they call it in Windows 8 so keep in mind 
on some computers Windows key and print screen but on some computers like my Toshiba I have to hold function Windows and then tap the print screen so it might be different on your computer um, take a look at the colors on your keyboard if the print screen is a different color from the rest of the letters it means that you might have to use a different key so if you enjoy these uh, videos please uh, subscribe to our channel and you'll be informing new videos online if you have any comments questions let us know maybe you have a request of a feature you'd like us to talk about let us know also and uh, if you have that new Windows 8 machine and you uh, want to learn more well we have lots of videos online to show you how to do stuff with your Windows 8 machine and how to use it so this is a great great place to be if you want to learn more on Windows 8 so thanks for watching and hope you come back to the official Windows 8 channel bye bye